What's going on, socialites? Ryan here, bring you game two of our Jolteon day for Evolutions week. Jolteon, unfortunately, did not do anything in our first game for Jolteon day. Let's see if we can get him to do a little bit more. And once again, we go up against a nutty OU team. Oh. If anyone in the community wants to have some, like, fun battles... Just like, man, you gotta go up against these sweats again with a blissey. Just, 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 just. Heat Ram looks really important here. Um, they have Garchomp to check Jolteon. Tangrowth doesn't seem like the worst Pokemon to lead off with. Alright, let me just jot down their team real quick. Scizor, Rotom Wash, Breloom, Garchomp. Yo, I can't wait for the uh, Draft League battles to start because then, then you get some fun teams and I won't have to just play against the same, like, ten Pokemon over and over again. And no one drafted Blissey, which is really good. Okay, so... They go with Garchomp. Which means we can get a Sleep Powder off here pretty easily. It could go right into Breloom, but we also wall Breloom, and we got Slug Bomb, so I mean, I think something's definitely going to sleep here, unless this has the Lum, or we miss. There's always that. There's always that. Okay, they do switch out. Which makes me think they are not Lumberry. They go into Scizor, who will be able to put a sleep here. Thank you. <clears throat> that will then allow us to get a knockoff. Stopping any of their passive recovery if they are a leftover set. And to me, it does not look like they have much that appreciates a Magma Storm, so they did not switch out. If Scizor stays asleep another turn, this will be really big. Yep. So we can just get off a uh, Magma Storm here. I mean, Blissey could come in. But if they just want to give me Scizor, right, that's pretty nice. And if Blissey comes in, I'm not worried about anything that it can do to me. Okay, they do switch out. They go into Rotom. So again, if this if this is offensive, it's not going to like getting this Magma Storm here. Yeah, it's going to be close to 50%. Let's see what item they have. Oh, that's a crit. Okay, so that makes me think it is defensive then. We do not see leftovers, though. Um, Volt Switch is pretty likely. Uh, I mean, Tangrowth walls like everything it can it can do too. <laughs> Probably Specs or Scarf. There's the Volt Switch. We take that. Pretty bold with the Volt Switch. I could have just clicked another Magma Storm. Roasted up something else. 
Here, they go back into Scizor. They will wake up here. So I want to go into... Garchomp just to get some chip on them. Oh, they actually stayed asleep. Let's just get our rocks up then. They switch out. Okay, so next time they'll definitely wake up. Back out into Rotom. We always have the Tangrowth play. Will-O-Wisp is fine. The Scizor is still asleep, so I'm not going to Sleep Powder. I will respect the OU Sleep Claws. They do Volt Switch. Uh, going into Scizor is pretty easy for them. Yep. Paprika. But now Scizor is going to start taking Chip as it comes in. And it will wake up this time. Which will be very nice. Tangrowth is just stalling us out with all of its stuff, so we can do the Garchomp play again. Again, I'm just trying to chip this down. U-turn uh, is very obvious. Oh, Defog, okay. Probably roosting here. No, they just U-turn, so we get some more chip. Again, we're getting him low. Next time he comes in, he'll be at about a third. We're, we're kind of doing this dance, right? Like Scizor into Rotom, into Garchomp, into Tangro. So some, someone has to break the chain. Um, I come out on that, like, every time. Alright, they do switch it up here, though. They go with Alakazam. You have Jolteon, which is faster. They do go for the Nasty Plot. They're going to have to go for a Focus Blast here, which does have a chance to miss. We also have a chance to miss, but Magma Storm still seems like the best play. They, ooh, they miss. Do we hit it? We hit ours. That's huge. I mean, that's Focus Blast for you. So we get some real good damage on them. Ugh. I think we gotta, like, kind of risk it. 
Like, do we need a heat ramp for anything? Like, Scizor's getting real low. Um, Rayloom is walled by our Tangrowth. So, I don't really think we need heat ramp for anything. We avoid two Focus Blasts. Will this Earth Power be enough for the KO? It is. That is huge. Takes down one of their big uh, threats to our Tangrowth. Um, I'm fine with sacrificing Heatran here. I do not want to let them try to get up a sub. They just go with Spore. Again, I don't know if they're going to obey the Sleep Clause. So, again, we don't really need Heatran here. Okay, they are the subset. Which is scarier. We wake up. We miss the Magma Storm, though. Um, they might try and go for another Spore. So this time, I am going to switch out into Tangrowth. Um, and we can Sludge Bomb them. We should be able to take the Focus Punches. Yeah, especially with them not going for it that turn. They switch out. Probably back into Scizor. Yep. Paprika. Paprika is going to take more damage. This is a good roost turn for them. Rotom's at like 50, but I'm pretty sure it's most likely Scarf, so I don't know if Gyarados can do it yet. Heat Ran's still a good play. They go for the U-turn, that's fine. This could be Garchomp coming out now. Or it could be the Breloom again. Because they do know they're faster. Yes, it is the Breloom again. Um, again, we're in this cycle where I just have like the better switch-ins. And you saw last time they broke the cycle and they paid for it. Yes, they did miss two Focus Blasts, which definitely hurt. But I only really need them to miss one. I want to get Swellow in. Because if we can get Swellow in and get its Flame Orb activated, that'll be really good. Okay, I'm, I'm going to break the cycle here. I'm going to predict that they'll switch back into Scizor. Like, they don't lose anything from that. No, they do not switch out this time. Ooh. This could be real bad for us. Let's let's see what they... What they, they do the focus punch. Alright. Swallow, sorry. I tried to get you in. <laughs> I tried, buddy. <laughs> I don't think that crit mattered. Swellow is uh, pretty pretty frail. Uh, 
All right. Wonder how. Uh, no, we we don't have to do that yet. Yep. Mm. See, we we broke the cycle, so now we lose them on, and th this is just how it goes. But we are weakening them, which I do like to see. They can't take too much more from these. Okay, Defog, U-Turn, like, why have they not roosted any, any of these turns? Alright, I'm gonna try and get Gyarados in. Because last time, they kind of let Scizor do its thing a little bit. When it, when it was asleep. They do switch out this time, though. We do have Lumberry. dance here. They can't spore us because you know, we have the Lum. Focus Punch can't KO us. Alright, but we have the Lumberry. Ice Fang still isn't a guarantee, though. I guess we just gotta hope for... Ugh, yeah. That's really unfortunate. I mean, we do have some turns to wake up here. Because they can't sub. They switch out. They are faster than us, though. Alright, uh, we're... We're getting Jolteon in, guys. It's Jolteon Day. We're getting Jolteon in. Let's go. Let's go. Get a hype. Get a hype now. We're finally doing it. <laughs> we're, fi we're finally doing it. You, you, you forgot it was on the team this whole time, right? That this was like a Tangrowth sort of showcase. But we're, we're, we're getting it in now. We are getting it in now. Yep. There's the Garchomp. Oh no, the Blissey. Ah, oh, the Blissey! Wow, you, you freaking, you, you madman. You absolute madman. Wow.
The absolute maddest of men. They get up their stealth rock, which is definitely going to hurt. We're burning turns of sleep. Oh, God. Oh, God, this game. I tell ya. Like, Sub Punch, Breloom, Scizor, Blissey, like, oh, fun, fun core, buddy. I mean, we're gonna win, we have more HP. Like, fun, fun core, you, you, you really, uh, play a lot of games with this, I bet. I don't think he's burned any turns of sleep, so unfortunately this is his last turn to do anything. Yeah. I'm sorry guys. Uh, I didn't really get to showcase Jolteon that much. Um, it is what it is, right? When you gotta play against teams like this. Seems to be all we really go up against. You know? People think they're on showdown and we can spend, you know, an hour playing playing this game. Wow, I win. Yeah, so make sure you hit that like button for that win. Um, you know, freaking. Oh, let me know in the comments if I made my own community code that I would go into. Would would you guys want want to play in that? Like, maybe we'll make a rule like, oh, you can only bring three OU Pokemon or something. You know, like, make our own basic rules. Let me know on that because. If you notice, I go up against a lot of these very stally, bulky teams, and if you watch the Vaporeon video, which I'll have pop up right here, um, against the stall team, you see I was out playing them, like, the entire time, but I mean, what what are you gonna do, right? You, They got Blissey, they got Gliscor, they got Scizor, right? Like, these are very bulky Pokemon with recovery. That 20 minutes, you don't have enough time to, like, wear them down. You saw we were so close to wearing down that Scizor. Um, that would have been a nice switch into Gyarados again, but 20, 20 seconds left. I knew that was going to be the last turn, so is what it is. Um, I'll try to get another Jolteon battle, or maybe we'll showcase on another team, because that, that was just disappointing, not being able to do anything with Jolteon. But yeah, thanks for watching. As always, Socialites, please give the video a like. Please subscribe. Uh, please don't use all these stupid bulky... You know, bring one, bring two. Like, yeah, I brought Tangrowth. That's one. That's one bulky regenerator. You know, and it if you have special attacks, it, it goes down really easily, right? People who bring these Blissies with the Scizors... Like, if Blissies your only one, fine. I'm cool with that, but you bring Blissey with the Scizor, with the Sub Punch Breloom, you know, and it's like, what what are we doing? With the Gliscor, you know? I don't know, but again, thanks for watching, guys, and as always, stay classy, society.